Shanoa Miner here from MyBedBugStory.com and today I'm going to talk to you about the life cycle of the bed bug. I think it's important to know because this is the enemy and the more you know the enemy, the better you can attack it and, and, and plan your defense. So first of all, the adult female can lay between 1 and 12 eggs a day. And so there's an average a lot of times that we just consider about 5 eggs every day. So we'll look right here at the life cycle. We'll zoom in and you'll be able to see the visual that I have for you. So it starts out as an egg. Now the eggs are sticky and they it makes it hard so for regular cleaning sometimes you might not be able to get it with a vacuum. The only thing that I have found that actually kills the eggs is a product called Bedlam that you can buy online for ten to twenty dollars. Um, and so we have the egg. Now once the egg hatches it's our first stage of a lot of the larva and it's the nymph. This small stage as you can see on the uh, picture it's clear, they're not red, they're just more of a clear, some call it a straw color or beige. Uh, it just doesn't have that red or brown appearance. They haven't had a blood feed yet, and so they're just this kind of opaque, clear color. They do have to have a blood feed in order to molt, and they molt five times. Now this original nymph can live for months, perhaps without a blood feed. I say perhaps because it really depends on the temperature is a factor that goes into play, but I know one study was done where they were the, the nymphs were left at room temperature and they lived for six weeks before they died. And then you can have, then at the first, after the first blood feed, then it's the second stage. And then at this stage, a study was done where they had, they kept them at 50 degrees Fahrenheit and they lived without feeding for 275 days. They kept others at 99 degrees Fahrenheit and those lived only 17 days without feeding. So it really depends on the temperature, but they can live a while without feeding. And so that's why just abandoning your place doesn't really work when you're trying to get rid of these bugs. They can live a long time without eating. So as you see here then they go through the stages. Here's the first, the, after they eat they'll have the first molt, second, third, fourth, and the fifth molt. Here we have the adult. Only the adults can lay the eggs. All these other stages, they're called the larva stages. At the adult stage, they can start reproducing and laying the eggs. This picture here shows an adult that hasn't fed, and then this is what they look like when they have, after they've fed and they're full of blood. So they're really different looking depending on whether they've eaten or not. The, to go from the whole stage from egg to adult, as long as there's a food source, takes about two months. Without a food source, obviously it takes longer. Um, they, they will eat every few days, so as long as they can do that, it'll move quickly, but when they can't, they can live a long time without feeding. And the adults, can they've been shown to live over a year even without feeding. So they are hardy, and this is, this is the cycle that they go through. If you have any questions, go visit MyBedBugStory.com to learn more or to just Find out how you can get rid of these on your own if you need the help with that. MyBedBugStory.com. Thank you.